Welcome back to Lords of the Fallen. Um, I think I'm just going to title this one Side Quest or something to that effect. We won't be killing a boss in this video. We're just going to work our way towards the Guardian and knock out a bunch of side quests on the way. So it's going to be pretty well edited. Lose all that. Just get out of the way. The blind enemies out here have been replaced by actual Rogar. Oh no. What will I ever do? Shoot his dumb ass and be done with it. Yeah, that sounds about right. Uh, we're gonna go down and look for the monk's missing brother since that's right here. It'll require us to go down here and. I thought there were enemies in here. They apparently removed them all together. Despawned them, whatever. But in here, because there's a giant spider right around. Which. Right after killing the first warden, if you take this guy on and win, props to you. Because <laughs> he's tough as shit when you're that low level. But I drop him like two hits. Whatever. Out of the way, you annoying fucker. That's what I said. Get out of my way, you annoying bastard. Here we have a human skull. Yeah, I didn't have all of them, by the way. I thought you only needed 25. You actually need 30 to finish that. So, obviously I didn't have all of them. Look at this annoying asshole. You get the trophy, though, for 25, which I don't understand why that is. You should be required to collect all of them to get the trophy. Ha, eat a jump attack, asshole. My fellows, as much as I appreciate our common understanding that something needs to be done, I cannot fully support this manifest, especially point three is questionable. How could the Rogar help us restore peace if they do not even talk to us? How could we be sure to use them for our cause? We all want to see Antanas gone, true. But more bloodshed in her business. This cannot be the way. Right there, that also goes back to the very beginning of the game. I just opened that door up. For shits and giggles, a spider is laying eggs to be annoying. So the eggs will burst open quickly, and baby spiders will come out and just annoy the shit out of you. Another human skull. Perfect. Thanks. Duh, you need to kill now because I'm shit. Riveting, isn't it? Me standing in a pool. Let's take this barrel. So there's more spiders down here. Hello, asshole. One shot from a heavy attack. I love it. That is pretty awesome, though. Like, one heavy attack and he's done. Back up here. Right, there's a floor panel. And My friends, anyone. perhaps we can make use of the Rogar to win against Antanas. If we let them in, Antanas will fall, and we will be able to rebuild on the ashes. We only need an individual who could pave the way for the Rogar, and they would do the dirty work for us. And there is the audio log that tells you how the Rogar got in. They were let in by, you know, one of the monks or one of the guards, or somebody who was betrayed antennas. Couldn't remember where that door was. It's over here. I'm gonna kill this guy spider first. Two hits, you're done. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, it's this door. That's the door that's on the floor panel. This door, I think, has a checkpoint in it, though. Yeah, not that we need it, but what the hell. We'll just activate it. Is this another human skull? Probably. Oh, that's some sort of key. Again, struggling to read the small preview screen, don't really care. We need to, uh, well, I guess heal, but what we need to do is go back and activate that floor panel and run this door here. That door. Because in there is where we'll. And the monk's brother quest. 
which I don't even think I turn that in right away. I think from here I go down to the healer monk. Hmm, we'll see. Yeah, I do. I've already edited the video. I ran past the door because I'm stupid. The Thor here, dumbass. There's a spider in here. Annoying spider. No. Fine, you bite me. You bite me all the really like poisoning me, too, I gotta say. Right here. Take it, stupid. Right there. That's the monk's brother's corpse, but they don't really tell you that. Interestingly enough, you just find a key. Okay, we are going to turn it in. Did you find my brother? Your brother is dead. Eaten by spiders. Here. Found this on his body. Dead? Just like that? Keep it. I don't want anything to remind me how he died. Exactly. A lot of experience. I'm good with it. I mean, yeah, if you listen to the monk's dialogue, then you know that that's what you need. Now we're talking to the healer. I can bring them back. I'm sure I can bring them back. I see you have cleaned up the bodies. This is wonderful. Now I can start to search for a cure. I need space to work. And Tamas disagrees, but I know it can be done. There must be a way. What are you researching? All these unfortunate people infested by demons. I, I have to help them. There must be a way to help them. So you disagree with Antanas? Yes. Antanas believes that evil can be banished from humanity, but the ones he exorcised, they... they don't seem to be completely human anymore. There must be another way. You promised to give me some potions. I can't do much with a laboratory in a state like this. But I may be able to enhance your potions. Perhaps if you help me a bit more, I could give you even better potions. Help? How? I need more fresh Rogar blood so that I can study its properties. I think I need their hearts. Bring me some Rogar hearts, but I suspect they'll need to be bigger ones than from the Rogar in the monastery. How many do you need? At least four, but the more the better. I'll see what I can find. Thank you. Yeah, I'm just going to talk to him again right away. And so I do believe I have four Tyrant Hearts. You should, at this point in the game. Welcome back. Do you have the Rogar Hearts I asked for? I think I found them. Here you go. Yes, that's perfect. Wait a moment. Now, this healing potion is powerful stuff. Give it a try. It's a bit more powerful now. Bring me more hearts, and I'll see what else I can do. Yeah, now the potions really heal a lot. I think if you bring him additional hearts, you get just experience for it. But it's not bad if you just want some free experience and you don't mind running around like an idiot like I'm doing currently. Time for another jump cut. Yep, in the Rogar realm. Again. Yes, Guardian, you look all badass. Don't worry, we'll be failing our way through him in the next video. In the meantime, we'll look at another tyrant. Do you mind, Bob? I'm trying to distract you so I can look at your fucking heart. I think it's right behind him, right on this bridge. Yes, attack the prayer. That's a good tyrant. What an idiot. <laughs> Here's 
was hard. I'll take that. Hey, what are you doing over there? Oh, right, he was attacking my prayer like an idiot. I was thinking about doing a jump attack on him, but then I went to let myself any stamina. I did one anyway, because <laughs> I'm a dumbass. <laughs> he still dies in two cuts thanks to the jump attack. He dropped some. He sure did. The other western antechamber key. Cool. I think that's the one for the... Yeah, the one for the lower locked door. And there's an asshole wizard up here. Looking forward to this, totally. Thank you, asshole wizard. Thank you again. I'm so gonna murder you. Do I not have the energy to swing the axe? Apparently not. Okay. Fuck this guy. You're gonna fly away like an asshole, then I'm just gonna shoot you. Fuck you. Yeah, that's what I think of that guy. You can go ahead and blow up safely over there and hurt no one. Do I need to do anything with the smith? Not right now, no. Hey, Harkin! What You're now? still here. Listen, you should avoid the monster in that arena. Use the secret way that leads through this tower. And come meet me in the place where you fought that three-legged stool. If you do, I can show you what I have discovered. Yeah, we'll follow her for now. We're gonna kill the Guardian, but we'll follow her for now, just so we can get the bonus XP for her side quest stuff. Um, I suppose we're gonna upgrade something while we can. I think I actually busted into my ability point stash here, just to get... Uh, yeah, I do, because I want Quake le at level 3 now. Where I'm going. Or my attribute point stash, yeah. So we'll put that to 21 right now. But then I need a spell point. I was just on it. Yeah, <laughs> with the program, dumbass. What am I doing? Put Quake at 3. Good. <laughs> my magic bar is almost as long as my energy bar now. That's pretty scary. Ideally, with a warrior class, the energy bar should be about as long and as then the health. we <laughs> Not sneak the other out from behind and stab them. Hey, look who's here! What are you doing? Well, we managed to find something to eat. <laughs> a rogar. Where's the third guy? Oh, yeah, right. Uh, third one. Uh, uh, didn't make it, I'm afraid. We tried to eat him, but he was a bit stringy. Rogar flesh is way tastier. <laughs> you should try it. And that's why it was a waste of a potion. You're out of your mind. You need to get out of here. No way. This is our new home. But that giant monster in the arena is really getting on our nerves. That's why we're going to kill that giant bastard. Kill the Lord. Listen to yourselves. Get out of here while you still can. But... but who'll protect us from the Captain? I'll tell him that I killed you. But I need your tattoos as proof. Our tattoos? Yeah. Rip them off. Better this than running away or dying here. Here. Take this amulet we found. It'll be more use to you than it will be to us. Wait, so we ripped their tattoos off and they didn't scream? Yeah, sure that really happened. Or like we held them, I Harkin held them down and cut them off. And that didn't attract any attention either, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, oh, he gave, they gave me something. I'm struggling with this again because I'm stupid. Yeah, the Amulet of the Betrayer, what the hell does that do? Oh, right, that's the one that increases your damage, but I think it hurts you at the same time. That's what it looks like. Anyway. What am I looking at? I have all the tattoos, that's what I was checking. Back to the captain! Yeah, all the way back there. Which, we're now there. Hooray! Captain? What is it now? Did you deal with those deserters? 
they didn't scream much. Here, take their tattoos. So you've really done it, hmm? Not bad. Here, take this amulet. It could be of use. Oh, fuck yeah, it could. He just gave me great burden, which this thing is a beast. I won't put it on right here, but the next time I, when I cut away from here, I'll have it on. It basically says I can no longer be knocked down. I'm serious. I mean, it could still be knocked out of rolls and stuff like that, but like normal attacks that would knock you down, just they don't knock you down. Putting it on, though, makes me fat, so I have to fix that first. So now we're back here. Outside the Guardian Room. What we're going to do is start raising endurance. I'm fat right now because I have that on. I replaced the other one with it, the one I had before that was raising my carry weight. So to fix that, we're going to go down to the Craftsman and slot a Luck Rune in our armor. Maybe again. At least that's the idea. Thinking that putting a luck rune in the armor will give me more carry weight, and we should be good at that point. Just... Oh, I do have one in there already. Oh, look! We'll put this higher luck rune in here, and we're... Should be good, I think. Yeah, we're good. It doesn't show up right away. <laughs> so you have to actually exit first to see the difference. But all oh right, we're going to follow Yetka this way. That's what we were supposed to do. I think I like go out of my way. No, let's open this door first since I now have the key to it. Yay. Body log shards. They fall wherever there's a rift. The matter of both dimensions clashes and crystallizes in this incredible fall of power. Some bigger rifts they form broken shards so big and heavy, and it's impossible to move them. Who knows what power they hold? Alright, cut out a bunch of extra dicking around there where it was just killing enemies that I didn't need to kill and just wasting time. This is the path we needed to follow Yedcon. Come through here. Don't want to go out there. No, nope, no, nope, don't want to face the Guardian yet. Let's come up here and show this dimensional beast who the boss is. Two hits, yeah, sit down. Fuck you. <laughs> exactly. I'm not going to mess with the asshole forager. I don't need to. This dog is interesting. Oh, what? You don't want me to hit you. Believe me, you don't. Hit him, he runs off. It's hilarious. No, it's not a bug. <coughs> That's actually supposed to happen. It's part of another mini little side quest thing. Which we're gonna do, like, as soon as we go down the stairs. Take a left. I'll just wait for my health to come up. La 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 la. Dimensional butthead down here. <laughs> Look at him, he thinks he's a badass. He's like, oh, I'm gonna kill you, Hargan. No! Jumping attack almost does the trick. And the poison did, though, so I actually only hit him once with my axe and he's done. I like that. But up here and to the left is where that wounded dog ran to. We don't want to hit him right away, we want to wait for the ambush. Go ahead. La la, maybe. I'll just dodge. Wait for the ambush. Yep, oh, there's the ambush. Okay, now we can kill them. It's basically the same group we fought out here. Before. Three dogs and a forager. But if you do it this way, wound the dog, wait for them to ambush, etc., then kill them all, the forager will drop an up trinket. Yeah, you go ahead and try and drink that shit. Just try. There it is. It's called The Keep. What does this do again? Let's find out when I check it. I, I believe it increases your defense stat. 
the description seems to say that it, that's what it does. I mean, I can't read it now. It's, the print's way too fucking tiny, but from look, from when I played it the other day and read it, that's what I believe it does. I don't know, the Great Burden is superior to all right now for me. So I just don't like being knocked to my ass. It's bad. Ignore all these fucking clowns. Uh, by them, I mean the archers on the ledge and just run right up here. Uh, up here, the annoying Rogar is. The witch doctor, whatever the fuck his name is. The guy who's cook all the time. I was actually going to go and deal with him, but I realized that I missed a skull. Since I'm retarded, I'm dead serious, I missed one. There, the last one, the one that I missed, is was like a room away from where I picked up Curse in the last recording. I'll find it, you know, when I go to the end of the game. But at that point, it's not going to matter, so we're not going to see that one because I'm a fucking idiot. So, let's just move on. Let's kill this guy just because it's going to be fun. I'm just going to wake him. I bet it does the same thing. Yeah, dead. Fuck you. Level 3 Quake is overpowered. Like, seriously. Enemies without magic resist just fall over really quick. I missed something, didn't I? Ah, I got it. Take that there sealed rune. Take that there sealed rune. Hey, you don't feel like fighting spiders again, so let's not go out that way. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna hit this checkpoint. I don't think I am. I might check in. I, I might use the checkpoint, but I might. I don't think I'm gonna refill on it. I don't need to. It looks like. It's hard. I, I think that's an 8 on my potion indicator again. It's all previous screens, so I would only be down 1. Hey, dumbass archer. Yeah, go ahead and throw that. That doesn't hurt me much. Yeah, you're dead. That one I've already cleared. That was treasure one. Yetka's down here. It's a hell of a sprint you just made there, Harkin. Oh, finally you bless me with your presence. Ha uh ha. -huh. You wanted to show me something. Yes. The place I've been looking for must be behind this door. Ugh. If I could enter, I could find out why the Book of Lineage pointed me there. So, open the door. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, wait, I did. Still, it won't budge. Let's see what we can do. What do you expect to find in there? I want to know why my mother left me the Book of Lineage. I could find out what secrets my family was hiding and why. It's clearly got to be something valuable. And if the book leads you to treasure, what then? I don't know. Look for another one, maybe? Do you still need the dagger? I already found the pathway. You keep this. There must be an easier way to translate it. Why not ask one of your relatives? They speak the language, after all. They're all dead and buried, Harkin. I'll get no answers from them, in this life at least. I'm the only one left. How long have you been trying to translate this book? None of your business. Yeah, I swear she has like a cloak of invisibility or some bullshit, because the Rogar completely ignore her. And we'll see that, especially later. There'll be like a tyrant standing like ten steps from her that just won't even give a shit that she's there. <laughs> oh, good. Open the door to an asshole wizard just who I didn't want to see right now. Yeah, put up your bullshit barrier. Let's go back over here and hide, I guess. Break line of sight so you can't use drain life on me. Fuck you. I don't even care that I took some reflected damage for that. It's dead. End of story. As long as we have enough magic for Quake, because I'm going to need that pretty quick.
what do we have in here? Oh, nice shot. Scenery shot there. I like the mountains in the background. That's pretty badass. Um, I think that's an armor piece. Ah, the ghosts. Yeah, fuck this guy. Ghosts are like a variation of the asshole wizards. But they're only really affected by magic. Had I hit it with my axe, it would have done, like, almost nothing to it. Bloody and she's mysterious. I've got it. This place. This place is the knowledge. My family might be dead, but they left me this one book, and it's a map. It was a map all along, and now I will finally be able to read it. I'm so close. I need to decipher this. In the meantime, why don't you find out what that large gate is about? The answer must be somewhere in this tower. Oh, yes, it is. Need my magic to come back up to... Good. I need enough for a quake. At least one. I think there's another ghost on the ground floor. Hmm. That... I don't know where that takes me out. Or, yeah, it does take me back out. There's a ghost. Well, fuck you, buddy. Ah, he phased into the wall. What an asshole. Of course my magic can't hit him when he's in the wall. Let's use a gauntlet. I think when I put a flawless rune in there, it'll one-shot them. I'm not 100% about that. This does not open. Aggravating, but I'll just deal with it. There's like three levels to this tower, and I don't like it all that's on the top. Get out of my way, you idiot. What did I just pick up? Apparently it's a weapon that I want to look at. Oh, the artifact. Yeah, it's shit. Clearly the runes are like ghosts that travel between the dimensions. That they form links between them and transport powers from one dimension to another. A rune can bestow incredible power on the simplest of objects. But I must be careful. Handling runes is dangerous. Yeah, right. Back over here by this... There's a save crystal here, but there's also a ghost next to it. Fuck you, ghost. See that residue they leave around, by the way? That can stun you and do damage after you kill them. It's really annoying. They're not as annoying as the asshole wizards, because I can one-shot them. But they're still annoying. There's another one of those statues we can smash. We'll do that, by the way. We'll smash all four of them. And get the entire, uh... What the hell is the name of it? What the hell is the name of that armor set? Ah, well, no one I, I remember when I start picking it up, I guess. It's a really cool armor set. I think it's medium, though. But it provides better protection than a lot of the heavy armor in the game. I think I actually wear some of it for the Annihilator fight. Oh, uh, this fucking guy again. This guy actually, like, made me salty. I, this thing killed me way too many times. You're not going to see more than the first death, but... I failed at this guy way too goddamn much. It's, for some reason, he's a lot stronger than the one that I faced down in the city. So that he almost killed me in, like, three hits. Poison resist up doesn't fucking matter. It still crushes. Look at how good those potions are. Right? That full heal. Oh, he's still got over three quarters of his health left. Now, that's bullshit. Shouldn't have been able to knock me down, but yeah, these guys, I swear, do not abide by any rules. My health just drained right out. 
fuck that guy. Sure, it's my own fault for standing in front of him like a complete moron. But... I don't care about the ghost, I'll deal with him up here. Because he will follow me, just to be really annoying. Oh, my experience is over here now. Oh look, a rune chest, how nice. The ghosts just stunned me. They have some sort of spell that does that. It's really annoying. We're gonna quake now, hopefully kill the ghost. Oh, yeah, you weren't anywhere near that. Of course you weren't. Why would... Why... Why would you be? Fuck you. Waiting on quake. Well, if the enemies aren't coming down, you know, what's my rush? La, 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 la. Wake these assholes. Ghost is dead. Poison fucker has mm, about a quarter health. So I don't even want to deal with him. Mm -hmm. Just back up away from my gauntlet to charge, I guess. Well, you're still not dead, you annoying son of a bitch. One handed. No, I did two handed. Now we can go up there and do what we needed to do. To open that gate that Yedka's standing by. Oh! Somebody dropped. That's nice. It's nice that they drop shit once in a while. We'll just go ahead and pull this here lever. The gate's open, but the door is sealed by a rune, so that's no big deal. What is in here? Yes, fine. We'll put a rune in the chest. I want to see what's inside. Uh, more medium armor. Don't care about it. Okay. Back down here. See those runes on the wall there? We'll be able to read that pretty soon. I'm so close. I need to decipher this. In the meantime, why don't you find out what that large gate is about? The answer That's what must I just be did. somewhere in this tower. Yeah, this is... I think this actually changes my objective to coming in here. 